Hi guys, Boris from Microweber here. Uh, today I'm going to show you how quickly and easily you can create your own website using Microweber without need of any coding, no coding platform. Uh, so you can just watch this short video where I will focus on the general general functions of Microweber. <coughs> okay, so let's begin with logging in our website. We are in the, our website uh, already, <coughs> so we are going. We are in the dashboard right now. So, quick view of the dashboard. Here we have a section, st statistics section. Uh, we have also email section, last comments, uh, recent orders, and sales. Uh, when you have something, something important or some notification, they will appear here. Uh, from this uh, statistic, you can check how many visitors you have online or daily or weekly or monthly actually uh, after that we have this website button let's open it the first step is design and uh, this is the general information of your your website which uh, template you're using we are using big template right now uh, which version site details uh, we have website structure here so this is the home page you have directly preview of the home page here also block when you switch it you already have a preview of it, of it. shop section uh, contact us page and empty page so <coughs> here on the left we have also the structure of the website pages as you can see these are our pages we can rearrange them quickly using the mouse uh, and uh, more more important things is this black menu button when you click it you are going to open the structure of the whole website so you can show it or 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 he, uh, make it hidden it doesn't matter from here you are close this tab uh, another another uh, tab is categories uh, right now we have just one category you can add the subcategory from here or new category from here we have a post section where your articles related to the block as you can see those are in the block section are and uh, <coughs> and uh, let's create a new page so a new page can be created from this plus icon here or go to the pages this three dots menu add new page okay so i'm gonna click on the this plus icon and uh, here are the types of the pages you you can create and categories so you can create new page new post article category or new product for this example we are using the new page here it is and uh, next step is to define what kind of page you like to add uh, for example micro will show you all of your pages structure of the website so uh, if you need uh, an, an additional services page you can choose it from here if you have it but right now i'm gonna choose the clean empty page create and here is our title demo page uh, when you type the demo page you see this uh, is published you can switch to unpublish or published uh, select param page we don't need add to navigation so i'm gonna select header menu and footer menu so it, this page will be directly on the header and footer navigation click on save and we are going to the live edit to edit our web page in live mode here it is the live edit because we're gonna uh, we start with the empty page is absolutely empty so you have just entered enter your title or, or your text so when you click on this and uh, select the pen tool you're going to edit the title or text Hop. this is my title this is my title uh, as you can see there is a, a text editor which is appear here uh, there is a button pin or uh, un unpin to top and when you click it the editor goes there and uh, you can focus on your text for example 
this is my example text here and uh, if you want to play with the editor it's uh, it's uh, very easy to use so you can do it when you when you start making your content so uh, let me continue with uh, the other things of microbar the cool things of it uh, here we have one button call it at layout uh, this is on each section on the top and the bottom of the of the section so we are using it to adding a new content to our website using the prepared layouts let's see we are clicking here and all of the layouts contained in this template arc are visible here so we have a, a lot a lot of content uh, prepared layout we we can use here they are separate by categories uh, it's easy to you for example if this is contact us you can choose directly contact us um, contact us uh, layout uh, in the features for example you have some different uh, layouts for the features and uh, it's for all categories in this way so I'm gonna use uh, for example this layout which is appear immediately on your on your screen and it's mobile ready and it's uh, ready for use so you're you probably want to change this image you need to select it first and uh, again using the pencil you are going to edit the page uh, the image so you can add image from your computer for, from URL you can use the uploaded images or from media library right now I'm going to use uh, image from my computer so I'm going to add it from my desktop here it is and it's uploading and it this is my image so as you can see we can uh, change the text clicking by the dot uh, by the pencil here so this is our uh, our our title uh, the same is uh, is with the text uh, you just click on the text and uh, start uh, removing or add um, some texts uh, the button probably you want to change the settings of the button you need to click on the button first so uh, uh, handles and settings related to the button appear up to the button so here on the this icon it's the settings of the button and you can see how I'm gonna change this for example cont contact us contact us is appear here you can go and choose link to link this button to some of the related pages already we have contact us section so I'm gonna click contact us and OK you are able also to to align the button for example you want it to be on this direction or in in the middle but I prefer to be uh, here as well so <coughs> this was a, a short presentation I'm clicking save short presentation how how you can uh, work with micro -ever. another layout if you're gonna add another layout for example this one uh, he is appear on the top you can define uh, the uh, the spacing between the the layouts you also have a settings menu here on the right where from the settings you can uh, choose a image background for this layout you can choose a video video layout for this background or color uh, color just simple color as I'm, I'm choosing right now so very important is to see that uh, there is a, a, a level of the color so it can be uh, fully fully um, colored or, or with some alpha behind so this is important because uh, otherwise you can you can think why the color is not the same as as I'm using it okay <coughs> so this is about the uh, the settings I'm clicking on it and uh, of course you can move this layout below or move it again on the top so it's very easy and uh, and useful you can also copy this layout or uh, or make it presets so when you when you want to use it in the same way as it designed here you can use it from the preset uh, 
layouts. So this was a uh, uh, very short presentation about the microwaver and uh, how to add a new page and how to add a new layout. And let me give you a, give you a little more spe uh, specification about the the controls here. So as you can see, we have a save button. When you click it, the content is safe. We have a quick view, which allows you to browse your website without without have uh, any any um, elements that are needed for the, for the content or the images. So you can browse using using this quick view. You can browse your website. Uh, when you click it, you are back to the to the. Uh, uh, settings so most important things are here uh, which is template settings editor yeah. from here you're going to uh, define all the settings of your website for example typography colors uh, headers uh, footers buttons colors forms everything actually and uh, I'm gonna to choose to check the fonts just to to font of the template so you can understand what uh, better what uh, what I mean here I'm using Times New Roman and as you see the 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 content of the websites it's is changing immediately so I'm going to back to just again this is the default uh, default uh, font you have also spacing line space which is for the text the the space between the text, I prefer it like this, or letter spacing, which is not okay to move it, but uh, if you need on some specific element, you can do that. Font weight, uh, as you can see, is uh, 400 right now. You can make it be better or less, bigger or less. Uh, select option, lowercase, uppercase, stuff like that. You have clean, clean all settings. If you are not sure what you are doing, you can uh, also clear it. Okay, another cool stuff. Uh, those settings you need to check check them out, so you can you can make uh, general changes of your of your website content. For example, button size. You have button radius. You can make it uh, square or more more um, smoothly. Border size. You can make it bigger or less padding horizontal vertical font size again so this is a cool stuff that are needed for making better view of your of your website another another option that i'm i want to show you right now is this dot where when i select for example uh, let's select this box when i go and open this tool this element style editor so you can also uh, change the typography from here, but this is only for the elements that you are selected. It's not working as the previous uh, previous settings for the whole uh, the whole website. This is only for the element. For example, background. If I want to change the background behind this section that I'm uh, that I'm selected, I'm click here and uh, pick another color. Uh, the same is for the spacing. If I need more spacing here, uh, I will I will type 200, for example, and 200 below. And as you can see, we have uh, an additional spacing, especially on the this uh, square box. Okay, <coughs> you can choose a border types on the top, on the right, uh, style of the top, solid or not, uh, rounded co corners, uh, for example. I will make it. Let's make it 100 for more visible effects, 100. And from here, you have animation also, shadow, classic, element, position. So from here, uh, you can control the current element of, of your, of, uh, your uh, layout. So this is it, actually. This is for, for a quick view of microwaver. You can check how your website looks like on mobile phone like uh, using uh, using uh, mobile phone icon and here is our template how it's look like on mobile so guys i hope this information was useful for you please try again microwaver and uh, be creative see you next time ciao